The development of the United States Air Force's Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD, program has moved forward and reached a new stage of development. The goal of the Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD, program, which originated from a 2014 DARPA Air Dominance Initiative study, is to field a new fighter aircraft in the 2030s to replace the F-22 Raptor. It won't be just one aircraft, but a number of manned and unmanned systems. Air Force Secretary Frank Kendall told reporters at the Air and Space Force Association's annual conference on September 19th that we are working on the actual design of the aircraft, so we are in the engineering, manufacturing development phase. The Loyal Wingman concept is still part of the overall NGAD program, and the future fighter could be accompanied by four to five drones. These robotic wingmen would carry a variety of payloads and be capable of performing a number of different tasks, which could be determined by the manned aircraft. It could be a team effort with one carrying a sensor, another as a bomb truck, and the other as a decoy to draw enemy fire. The goal would be to protect the human pilot and make sure pilot gets home safely. The drones would be expendable to ensure mission success while decreasing the risk to the pilot. There is a willingness to risk those platforms in order to obtain an operational advantage. Collaborative combat aircraft are multi-mission drones that can act as loyal wingmen for the manned NGAD fighter. These drones could also be used to test enemy air defenses, provide forward surveillance in high-risk areas, or deliver weapons. The human in the manned aircraft would still perform the command and control. The Boeing MQ-28 Ghost Bat, which was developed for the Australian military, has also received interest from the Air Force. It was designed to operate as part of a team, using artificial intelligence to extend the capabilities of crewed and uncrewed platforms. The U.S. Air Force has discussed the NGAD family of systems with its Australian counterparts, and it is possible that Australia will be able to participate. The MQ-28, formerly known as the Air Power Teaming System, is also being offered by Boeing for the U.S. Air Force's Skyboard Loyal Wingman program. The project is said to encompass a variety of systems that will form an artificial intelligence-driven computer brain capable of controlling both networked, loyal wingman-type drones as well as more autonomous unmanned combat air vehicles. It was also designed from the outset to be a modular platform that could be tailored for specific needs, which makes it well-suited to the NGAD program. 